You just don't know how to use it. Uh oh. Yeah. Oh, how about them apples? Woo! Poke, mm. poke, poke. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, I don't know, man. It's one of them days. It is, it is. <sighs> it, it's been one of those weeks. It's like yes. Murphy keeps jumping. Murphy says, how you doing? Yeah, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> we won't go into what that exactly means, but. <laughs> <laughs> I love the meme you found. You, you, bleh, 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 bleh. you found. It, that was a combination of found and picked. Yes. Um, you found for uh, today. I, I love it. I, I thought it, it was pretty hard. True. It, it is. It true. must be true. Cause this is a historically accurate picture of a selfie that Abraham Lincoln took. Circa 18-something. <laughs> it is probably one of the first actual selfies that are out there. And I believe if you look closely, it's that might actually be an iPhone. Uh, let's see. I can't tell it from this distance. but i got to turn the phone sideways. Oh, boy. Here we yep, go. Yep, it's, it's an iPhone. So there you go. Ah! That is proof of the existence of Apple. <laughs> Back in the 1800s, where apparently... Lincoln was a, an early supporter. Mm. <laughs> throwback Thursday, man. Throwback wow. Thursday. Not throw your back out. Please don't do that. Uh, no. That, I, that's I've done never, that. And I nice. did that once when I was stretching. Uh, <laughs> At least you were doing something. I, yeah, I was stretching and I threw my back out. I mean, really. So really. when I threw my back out and it was bad, it was so bad, it was almost a month before I could walk properly again. I was literally doubled in half and I had to walk with my head scraping the floor and I could barely move for almost a month. Ouch. And uh, how did this happen, you my ass? I, I was waiting. Yeah, so... I was doing some, don't remember what it was, and I had a piece of paper in my hand, and, uh, well, I accidentally dropped the paper. Oh, no. So I quickly reached down to grab it and snatch it back up off the floor, and on the way down, something went, <coughs> and I hit the floor. I was like, oh, I <laughs> <laughs> and that was it. I was I was pretty much on the floor for uh, I don't know most of the rest of that day. Where and this you... was at a time that I was by myself, so it's not like anybody could help out. I, I needed one of those little stupid buttons to help. I've fallen and I can't get up. <laughs> the life alert. Yeah, life alert. That's it. Like <laughs> ah. So I have a question for you. Were what? you over thirty? Oh, uh, was I really even? Um, I believe I was. <laughs> <laughs> this is the sign of. You know you're getting old when. Yeah, apparently I was uh, pretty out of shape because that kind of stuff never phased me before. But I bent over to pick up a piece of paper, apparently too quickly, and something went horribly wrong. Definitely a bad day. And turning into a bad month. I remember I had a door-to-door -door sales guy come up. And I thought it was somebody important. So, you know, I, I, I was walking, bent completely in half, dragging my head on the floor. And I reached up and opened the door, and I looked up, and the guy's like, are you okay? And I was like, no. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> it was horrible. Oh, no. Or she bends says, hey, 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 how you doing? Thanks and, for joining and us. And Carrie is waving. Ah, Hello, Carrie. Thank you guys for joining <laughs> yes, us. Thanks yes. for being a part of the network. We appreciate it. <laughs> So, yeah, that was one of those things that I actually let him in, and, uh... Uh-oh. <laughs> what do we got? Chris, there's some kind of glare coming from your chin area. I thought somebody noticed. <laughs> uh, you noticed this morning. I did. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I actually scared myself this morning. 
I went into the bathroom doing my stuff and I went back and I was doing some things for the mirror and I looked out and I was like, nah! <laughs> <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> I guess we should probably talk about that since yeah, it is and throwback uh, Thursday. It is, and um, I, I know people were commenting on it last night in the yeah, news. it's terrible. So I, I was doing the news last night, and apparently there were some comments that came through about something going on in this area. <laughs> and none of them came across on my screen. I had like four comments, and it was like, hello, and then a couple of wavy hands, and you asked me afterwards, you're like, didn't you see all those comments? I'm like, what comments? And you showed me. I was like, oh, I totally missed those. It would have been epic. <laughs> and those were hilarious, by the way. Thank you for that. The wave is saying hola. Oh, hola. <laughs> Good to see you. Thanks for joining us. <coughs> yeah, it looks like our, our internet is going all kinds of haywire here. Uh, apparently, it's one of those days. It I'm is. It you. is. One so, uh, so yeah, you had some comments last night. One person was even asking who you were and what you did with Chris. <laughs> <laughs> no, nope, it's still me. Throwback yes. Thursday, man. Back back in the day, this was uh, this was like standard fare for uh, for me. Are, are you sure it's standard? I just heard some. Uh, well, no, uh, no some sandpaper. Yeah, going there's, on. Some, there's some sandpaper, so not quite short enough. And I have a mop for hair, so <laughs> we'd have to go a little bit farther to uh, to make that like it was back in the day. Oh my goodness! Some twenty plus years ago. <laughs> twenty years ago. <gasps> no wonder you scared yourself in the mirror. I know. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> oh. It, oh, it just, yeah. It, so I got this wild hair up in my butt yesterday to do something <laughs> drastic. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> I feel like, you know, Lois has been kind of on the doldrums, you know, mm. for the last, I don't know, Years. a while now. <laughs> but it's been significantly worse over the last week or two. So I figured I would do something to cheer her up. <laughs> it didn't work. I she didn't. was horrified. <laughs> I came out and I was like, hi. And she was like, <laughs> I was. I was making dinner too, so it just. See, you should have seen the look of horror on her face. It was epic. Oh my goodness. So whether it made you feel better or not, it distracted you from your particular doldrums at the time. It did, it did. So, so it did work. Technically, it mission accomplished. Way, just not in the way you had anticipated. But sometimes that's the way these things work, you know. You, you have one set of plans to do this, and it doesn't quite work out that way, but it still accomplished the mission. Yes, and, and what's really... And now she won't even look at me. I will, I do. <laughs> <laughs> and... But what's really eerie about it is without the facial hair, okay, you and your brother. No. Uh, yes. No. Yes. Nope. It, it's like looking at twins. Ew. Except he, Chris has had the, Chris had the face first. <laughs> yes. He did, yeah, he, he looks like me. I don't look right. like him because I was first. But it's amazing how much you can tell how... How much related, how related you guys are, and, and you say whose twins genes were two years apart. I know, but you look like twins with your faces. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> Dave. What? Dave says, "Well, we do know where that wild hair used to be located." <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> my flavor saver is now gone. Oh my! You okay. went there. <laughs> of course you did. Well, you know that that brings up a thing. We, when we went to uh, Pipe Springs National Monument the other day, they actually had the coffee cups that had the mustache savers built in. Yes, Ooh, that was the funniest thing I've ever seen. I had no idea. Yeah, neither I did no I. Idea. So you got a little coffee cup, and in the coffee cup is a little place for your mustache to rest, and then a little hole at the bottom so you can sip it and not get it in your mustache. You just... It was hilarious. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. Like, wow, what a neat little invention. Yeah. That was pretty funny. It was. There are no was. flavor savers for them either. It, it, no, no. Um, but, yeah, it, it just... Mm -hmm. You can definitely tell you and your brother are related now. You know, every time you say that, it kills me a little inside. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I die a little every time. And you keep saying it over and over again. So eventually, probably by the end of today, I'm going to be dead and it's her fault. Uh, uh, no, no. <laughs> Excuse me, no. Yep. I'm just still trying to get used to it. 
Yeah, uh huh. How about now? It's a little weird. It, it really is. And I've known you, we've known each other for over 10 years. Uh -huh. And I've always known you with that facial yeah, hair. Yeah, it's never come off. <laughs> it hasn't. Yep, never come off. Now it's there. Oh my goodness. Whoop, so, there it gone. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> there it was. <laughs> yeah. Missing in action. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you, uh, <laughs> we were talking about it last night, and and I I had a bad day yesterday when I went shopping uh, for things for dinner, oh, and I that came was back. So annoying. And I came back, and so I started working on dinner, and Chris comes out looking like this, and I asked him. Because I was so not paying attention to anything. Yeah, she didn't notice that at first. <laughs> and I asked him, were you like that when I came home? No. <laughs> and he said, no, I did it really fast in the bathroom. and Because I was worried you were, you know, going to come in and see what was going on. And it's actually really surprising that you were able to do this in under five minutes. Yeah, it took about two, two and a half. Uh, yeah. And without cutting yourself. Apparently, I still I mean, have that touch. <laughs> you got that is to just do, do, that. That do. is just amazing. <laughs> Gina says you clean up pretty well. Why? Well, thank you. Although this yeah. mop of hair is gotta go. Now we just need to see you in in a suit and tie or some sort like that. There's only so far I'm willing to go. <laughs> just saying. <laughs> Someday when I'm some kind of Wall Street billionaire, maybe, <laughs> maybe, just so I can say I did it, you know, get one of them chrome-plated Italian suits, man. Like, yeah. Chrome-plated? Yeah. The more chrome that it looks like, the more expensive it is. That's how those things work. I Not actually chrome-plated. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm Ugh. like, um... No, no, I... they don't actually put chrome on suits. But I I'm was talking about wondering. The shinier they are. You know, oh, the, oh yeah. okay. The more okay. chrome-like they thinking, appear. I was thinking, yeah. okay, you're talking chrome-plating. No, no. in, in today's day and age, would be like a suit of art. <laughs> Wake up, Lois. Wake up. I don't know. It's just referring to the shininess level of the suit. Okay. Okay. So they look the more chrome-like that they look, the more expensive they are. So See, and apparently for that's me, stylish. I think it and, looks and, hilarious. <laughs> and for me, I I know, <laughs> I understand or understood at one point in time. If it was shiny, it was shark skin. <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> totally, no, it's not a shark skin suit. No, 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 no. no. We're talking about the Italian suit, man. Yeah, have to get me a little fedora. Oh, yeah, boy. I actually have one kicking around somewhere, I think. I think you do, too. We've talked about it a few times. <laughs> <laughs> I like that thing. I miss it. But, uh, yeah, got to shave them up. So. Yeah, I just, yeah, and and we were talking last night because it's it, it's a difficult getting used to it's gonna take some time <laughs> um we did have uh, we we had that goal for for the gofundme oh yeah yeah and where you would do this and your eyebrows and at a certain level your head and i told you oh you and for those of you that are wondering no we didn't make that level ha, ha, ha. very funny yeah, but anyway <laughs> <laughs> but we're still trying um but i did mention how you would look just completely odd and I don't I don't think I could deal with it. <laughs> yeah. I'd still be around. But uh well, I keep I, in I, the doldrums, guess what's coming up next? Oh no. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Kool-Aid guy attacks again. Oh, oh yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I I think I'd just have to wear one big eye patch until we all grew back. <laughs> one big eye patch. <laughs> Isn't that like a sleep mask? I think so. <laughs> I couldn't remember the name of it, though. <laughs> the co I've had enough coffee, but it has yet to kick in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> sure. Yeah. So, obviously, you're seeing the levels I'm willing to go to to try and make your day better. I appreciate it. Thank yeah. you. Apparently not. No. Oh, boy. Insulting me? You look like your brother. No, I don't. He looks like me. <laughs> Hey, I was first. I was the original model. Everything else is a copy. A cheap copy, I might add. Oh. Just say it. Oh, no. That can't be. Only one. Hey, wait a minute. You just spit on me. No, that was water from my hands. Either way. Yeah, it's a water bottle. It's got 
Moisture. Uh, oh, no. Moisture. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, that's what happened to me for my throwback Thursday. I shaved off my face. Yeah, I see that. It's a little odd. It is. I scared myself. <laughs> Which I just find hilarious. Oh, what? <coughs> so Excuse mean. Me. So I have some things that I wanted to bring up today. Uh-oh. We had some things come across the feed, as yes. it were, and I want to go over those first. <laughs> <clears throat> so as everyone knows, there has been, shall we say, recent shenanigans with California ah. uh, when it comes to certain daily use objects, namely straws. Yes. What are you doing? I had a hair. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so th there's the whole straw fiasco that's going um, on currently with California. Started over in Europe, all based on malarkey. Oh, what do you, what do you have here? <clears throat> <clears throat> hold on, hold on, let's see what we have. <clears throat> <laughs> Dave says, Lois, don't hurt his feelers. He's becoming the girl in the relationship now. <laughs> Tell him he's pretty. Well, thank you, Dave. <laughs> we do appreciate it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Don't mess with me, man. <laughs> All right, oh, let, let's no. see what we have here. So I've got... This is... Uh, this This goes on to the, uh, the straw issue. Uh, yes, and issue yes. is loosely termed. Apparently, California has run out of shit to say that it's filled with cancer. Bleep? Yes, bleep. Sorry. <laughs> I can't help myself, because this is like the dumbest stuff. I'll kill you. <laughs> All right, there we go. <clears throat> so I'm going to transfer this over. This came across our feed. I think it was yours first. I've seen it a couple times, and um, it's funny. It is. I don't remember who shared this, but thank you, because it made me laugh hysterically, <laughs> which is always a good thing. I love laughing. Laughing, is, laughing is good. It's good for the soul. It is. It it's really is. Soul. And it's a good workout. You know, for your abs, if oh, you get uh. that belly laugh going. Ho, ho, ho. Uh, wrong Bean belly laugh. <laughs> oh, that one there. <laughs> All right, so here's your California stuff right here. Yep. Oh, boy. <laughs> I saw this. I about died. Oh, I don't remember who shared it, but thank you again. That was amazing. This is concealed carry in California. Yep, yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, yep. <laughs> you know, the sad thing is, you know, that, that, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. That is illegal in California on many levels. That magazine has too many straws in it, and the straws are illegal. Holy cow, what are we going to do? But anyway, <laughs> just saying. Are, are you okay over I'm, there, Lois? Yes. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm dying over here. <laughs> so, yeah, I saw that, and I was just like, oh, my God. This is amazing. Oh, boy. And you know, the sad thing is, it's probably not far from the truth in the near future. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. <laughs> Could you imagine, as a child, trying to, even as a teenager, could this level of state control, like 1984, could you have imagined it back then? No. I mean, wow. And people are like, well, I can kind of see why they're doing it. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> and so, uh oh. Oh, you gotta say when comments come in. She's just dying over here. No, I just saw it. All right, Renee says, "Good morning, Alien and Lois." Well, good morning to you too, Renee. It's nice to see you. Good you just morning, joined Renee. us and missed the entire explanation of what is going on with the alien's face. <laughs> just putting that out there. <laughs> this is what happens when you join us late. It's terrible. What time is it? It is 7.20. You are 20 minutes late. I say, where is my tardy slips? <laughs> We're going to start issuing tardy slips. <laughs> Take your fingers crossed. <laughs> so make sure you watch the beginning of the show later so you can find out what is going on here. Yeah, her tardy slip is we take away her straws. We take away, yes. Yeah. We will take away your straws. <laughs> papers, please, papers. You have straws? Oh, no. Not going to go there. I just had one pop in my head. <laughs> Probably not funny for some of our audience, so I'm not going to do Probably that. not. So, that that was the way. I have another one. I was going to say, all you have to do is scroll down. No, I know, but I, but we might have to resize it, so give me just a second here. <laughs> because this one was 
epic. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, one of our followers actually, uh, 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 Renee. Yeah, Renee actually put this up, but we also found it on Mike Rose. Facebook as well. Yes. So obviously everyone's having a good time here. And so remember with the whole when you were younger, could you ever imagine the level of just do that is coming out of the world today? <laughs> <laughs> and obviously your answer was no. This is the next level. And though we find it funny now, soon this will be coming to a town near you. <laughs> <laughs> just throwing that out there. Yeah. There it is. <laughs> Lap it up. <laughs> Renee says it's on my pillow. What, her tardy slip? Yes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, um, you know, it looks hilarious. We're laughing at it now. Oh. But soon this could be coming to a town near you. No. Just, no. Yeah, but who would have thought they would have been doing the straw thing in the first place? I know. I mean, come on. I know. It's just, no. <laughs> <laughs> And, you know, in all of this, I didn't even think of juice boxes because it's been so long. Yeah, how else and, are you supposed oh, to open the door? Right. Thing? <laughs> well, how else is a kid supposed to open? Right. And Capri Suns. Yeah, Capri Suns. <laughs> Not technically a juice box. It's a juice pouch. Right. Parent, well, you know what? That'll go with their sugary uh, drink tax and ban. So you don't need straws to open those anymore because mm. they won't be allowed to exist. Oh, no boy. sugary sweetness for you. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, coming Jake, to Jake an area was near saying, you. let it be the juice box one. <laughs> well, obviously he's got some predictiveness yeah, yeah, going does. on there. Yeah. Right there, man. Right there. I mean, come on. But like I said, it does fit in their narrative. You know, right now those are still legal, but soon they won't be because they know what's best for you and they have to take care of you. But what? I, I, I have one. Oh, what you got? Uh, one that is. Really defiant in uh, all of this. All right, all right. What you got? All right. We need oh, you want to? Wanna, okay. Over. All right. This, this is this is several, several things. Scroll up. I'm working You'll on it. You'll see it. You'll all see right. it. I, that that was mine right there. I'm waiting for it. this one. Oh gosh. Oh, no. all right. That one. What? Um. All right. Hold on. Hold on. It's a screenshot. Okay. Well, I've got to make it big yes. so everybody can see it here. Yes, Give me just a I, moment. I realize that. But, uh, uh huh. This is one of those. This is why we can't have nice things. Yep. Uh huh. <clears throat> and a defiant person. All right. Should I transition yes, over now? Yes. Okay. There we go. There we so, go. So, number one, Trump, major headline Trump caught on tape. Get me a Coke, please. Okay. Yeah. Why is that a big. Thing. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I for really those of you out know. there that either like or like Trump, I don't really care. Like, my question is, why is this a story? A good question. <clears throat> now, is it like some kind of reality see, TV show? I, I don't like, know. But what you cannot see because of the screenshot and the fact that there's a play button there yeah, yeah. is he's drinking his Coke with a straw. <laughs> he's using a straw. He's using a straw. Well, he better not be in California. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> But, I mean, it was just one of those where it was like, there are so many things wrong with this. Well, why is it a headline? I don't know. Now, um, <sighs> the, there, the little blurb about this uh -huh. says, President Donald Trump was caught on tape mm -hmm. ordering a Coke. CNN's, I don't know, I can't read the um, reporter's name, but um, this reporter reports on why that is so popular. And it's like, what? <laughs> but it's a it's a <laughs> Do they not have anything else to report on? I, oh he's drinking a no, he ordered a Coke. I, I know, right? Okay. But but this is one of the, the media outlets that's doing the whole, you know, uh, straws are bad, straws are bad. Uh, but they don't even report on the fact that he's using a straw. Not yet. <laughs> Pretty soon they'll hang his ass for treason on it. Right? <laughs> bleep. <coughs> oh, yeah. Bleep. All right. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> David he's says hello. Good. Hi, David. Oh, hi. <laughs> yeah, but, oh, yeah. But, yeah. I, I saw this one and went, oh, we're talking about the straws. He's he's drinking he's drinking with a straw. <laughs> yeah, and apparently that's big enough to make mainstream media. Yeah, drinking a Coke is big enough 
And it's like, this is why we can't have the nice things. I know, right? <laughs> Don't you guys have something else more interesting to report on? I mean, <laughs> seriously? <laughs> That's really digging at the bottom of the barrel there. Although I guess they're used to doing that. <laughs> David says at school, do they want kids to stop drinking the milk pouches? <laughs> oh, yeah, you got a good point. Although when I was in school, we had those little the, milk uh, cartons, cartons you had to try yeah. and figure out how to open. Uh, that was now, you not... did get a straw that you could stick in there sometimes. And I guess yeah. that would be banned right it, now. Yeah, yeah. I uh, I I remember trying to open those things, and it was like they were using beyond industrial glue to keep them closed. No, it's just they were they were <laughs> we were just kids and we're idiots. So, <laughs> <laughs> and so you'd end up opening the whole top up, so it's a big square, uh-huh. and then just yep. drinking it. Yep. See now. Um, or dipping your now illegal cookies in it. it, it yeah. <laughs> and I say now illegal because most schools will be like. You can't have cookies here. That's not healthy. I, I know, right? <laughs> I can't have a cookie. Oh, no. Renee says we need a bleep emoticon on the bottom of the comments. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, there is a bleep emoticon in the uh, in the emoticon section. There is a bleep one where it goes. It, it says, like, censored with a black thing. <laughs> so uh, if one of you guys would like to be out there and use it, you, just beep, 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 you could randomly <laughs> stick it out there. Just saying. <laughs> oh, my goodness. We'll, we'll allow one of you guys to be a censor. Mm, bleep, 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 bleep. So yeah, bleep, with, bleep, with bleep. us talking about the straws, it just killed me that our commander in chief. <laughs> <laughs> but like I said, I just it, how is that news? Why would you know what? I'm not gonna ask why. I'm just not. <laughs> Apparently, you know what? You were talking about the Jersey Shore thing. Apparently, everybody has turned into Jersey Shore mm, stuff. Pretty much. Like, oh, he ordered a coke. What does that mean? I don't know. He was thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying. I say it doesn't matter whether you like him or not. I know there's there's a huge polarization in the country. I frankly don't give a flying bleep. <laughs> Thank you. Thank but, you. <laughs> you know, oh, Dave found it. <laughs> hey, he did. Yay! I told you there was one in there. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I don't really care one way or the other. But the fact that a major mainstream news place is reporting on this as news. You know what? You gotta find yourself some better employees that can find actual news stories that matter to people. Although, since people do watch Jersey Shore, perhaps this is all the stuff that they're interested in nowadays. Good job catching yourself. (laughs) (laughs) Oh my. I don't know. Yeah, the collective the collective IQ of our poor country seems to be going down the toilet with stuff like this. Although the question is, is it just an illusion of that because of mainstream media, or is it actually going down? Uh, see, and I look at, at headlines like this, and I'm going, okay, what's the other hand doing? <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's that too. I don't know, man. I just. But then again, you know, it, it's mainstream media, so. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> All right, so let's move on to something slightly yes. more funny here. I've got no. I, I know, that. I know. <laughs> I have one that I want to bring up here. This came across my feet earlier, and I was laughing quite a bit. I bet. So, I bet. Because, <clears throat> yeah, this is becoming a rather large. Large trend. Yes, it is. Well, my my favorite thing here is, okay, so like essential oils and things of that nature, that is like really big right now. It is. And, uh, you know, they can have some great health benefits. Mm-hmm. They can have, I mean, they can do all th- kinds of things and depending on this and that. But either way, it's a big deal. And yeah. so this came across my feed <laughs> and I, it made me laugh. And because it made me laugh, I would like to share it with you. (laughs) (laughs) So I, I as well, I too, like essential oils. And, uh, well, yeah. There you go. (laughs) That is my favorite essential oil. (laughs) Next to synthetic motor oil for a racing engine. But either way, (laughs) this one is more edible. (laughs) Oh, my. And you can cook anything in it. Uh, Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, it is. I love it. Yeah, it oh, yeah. it's fun stuff. <laughs> did, did, but did, when I you were a kid, did you ever did your your parents ever um, collect bacon grease and then they had like a jar of it and they'd use it to cook other stuff later? There was no jar. What, was it just a bowl? It was or? a coffee container. Well, there you go. <laughs> yeah, there, we, we it had, was a coffee tin. Yeah, we had mason jars and there was a coffee. I remember the coffee one. What you got? <clears throat> oh. Brian Brian says, "Howdy from Redding, California." Oh, 
Hi, hi, Brian. Nice to see you. Thanks for joining us. The car fire is now at 35% contained. Yay! And the boys are um, are getting this bleep back. <laughs> All right. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah. Thank definitely. you for the update, and thanks for joining us yes, this morning. Thank you. That and uh, hashtag Shasta Strong. Shasta Strong. Is that, uh, what is that? Um, that would be uh, the area, Shasta County. Okay, good. Because I was going with the soda, and I figured that's not what he was talking about. <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry. No. Uh, that would be the area that um, is being affected um, by, by the fire. By the okay. fire. And, All right. <clears throat> yeah. And if I remember correctly, um, Redding is in Shasta County. Okay. All right. So, yeah. It's, All right. it's the northern uh, And apparently he has area. just now joined us. You should watch earlier in the episode where we're making fun of California. It, yes. It, it applies to you. Get out while you can. Unless, unless he was he was just now commenting and oh, yeah, been watching true. the that's entire true. time. Yeah. <laughs> yes, we love to make fun of pretty much everything, but California yes. seems to be our favorite whipping oh, boy for now. Oh my goodness! Well, you but know what? It's there stuff isn't like that. a lack of of stuff. They keep giving it to me. They do. It's they cheap do. entertainment. <laughs> just saying. So this is my favorite essential oil. <laughs> um, Renee says coffee mug in the fridge full of grease. Yep. Yes. Yep. And Shasta Lake. Shasta Lake. Okay. Yep. Oh, there you go. <clears throat> and it's not filled with soda. N n no. Okay. <laughs> no. No. Just checking. I, what, I remember my dad taking this up to um, the Shasta area, mm -hmm. and I was thinking the same thing, and then he took us to Calistoga, and I thought that that's, you know, while we were in Calistoga. Um, See, now I'm thinking Conestoga like a wagon. Oh, see, <laughs> for me it was Calistoga water because they used to do bubble water, oh. I, and I was disappointed. Oh. <laughs> but I was like, I was knee high to a grasshopper. <laughs> you still are. I, Did you? When you <laughs> are the grasshopper, yes. <laughs> or my dad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your dad's a bit taller. Yeah, yeah he is. Yeah, there is that. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, there, that was my essential oil thing. It just made me chuckle. I was like, ha, oh. Jamie says, that's my hometown area. <laughs> All right. I'm sorry. I'm glad you made it out. <laughs> no, no no offense to you, or maybe there is, but either way, we're just having Out of fun. California. <laughs> and out of California. <laughs> <sighs> well, we're glad that the fire is more contained. Thanks for yes. the update on that. Yes. We do appreciate that. And, uh, yeah, we hope, oh, man, that's, there's some it, bad it, stuff going on it, over there. There is. There is. So, and, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. it's worse than normal California being on fire. Yeah, that is it, not. That good. tends to be an annual thing, but not at this level. <clears throat> All right, so I'm gonna go this ahead and do this one. one that, I think. Uh, yeah, my dad actually shared this, and and if for those of you that uh, don't remember, uh, recently we were talking about my dad. He is the one that made me believe jackalopes were real until I was 17 years old. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> so anyway, this is one that came across my feet, and this is actually real. And his Are you sure? I'm uh, pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to double check, but either way, either way, what his comment was was hilarious. It said, This is the stuff nightmares oh, heck yes. are made of. Yes. <clears throat> so I'm gonna go ahead and transition this over. Now now normally Excuse me. normally I love these little critters. I mean, they're cute. This one, not it's so not much. little. Yeah. <laughs> um, so there you go. That, my friends, is a hammerhead bat. Apparently, so I have not looked to, to check the veracity of this. It just made me laugh because this is the stuff that nightmares are made of, and I love bats. I think they're cute. They're adorable. They're fun, especially the little fruit bats or the big fruit bats. Yeah, you know, the little fox bats. Depending on so where adorable. You are. <laughs> but this guy. Ooh, it is what nightmares are right now. <laughs> it is what nightmares are like, holy cow. <laughs> yeah. I just, no. Yeah, yeah, pretty Bats much. Bats are supposed to be cute. Yeah, that yeah, is not that cute. Is not it. He does not look happy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and I'm sure he's very friendly, but. Nope. That is not cute. <laughs> yeah, I like that. At least not to me. I like the fox bat today. Uh, yeah, like, yeah. No, no, no. yeah. And, and and vampire fruit. bats are actually cuter than oh, well, yeah. <laughs> that thing though. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably you know it evolved that way as a defense mechanism. People see that and run screaming. <laughs> yeah, I would. I would. Oh my goodness! Heck. No. Yeah, it's going to be fun. It really is. Like, Renee says, that's not cute. No, it is not. And I like it. It's like the fox 
pets, the little baby ones. Uh, yeah. They wrap them up like little burritos. <laughs> They're so cute. This is not one of those things. So, so, you know, if you can Google it, see if it's real. I have no idea. Don't really care. But it Kelly's, made me laugh. Kelly is uh, oh. giving you googly eyes, and Jamie says that's fugly. Yes. A yes. <laughs> little bit. That is definitely fugly. <clears throat> oh, so, yeah, I thought I would share that with you. This is the oh. stuff. Nightmare. It, it definitely is. It is. It is. It, it is. It is. <laughs> All right. Now we can move on to, to to some things that you have, Lois, because and I, there's one in particular that I would <laughs> like to go to <clears throat> because we were talking about the collective idiocy of society or the apparent collective idiocy of society, and it's things like this that make me think it's not the mainstream media that is projecting it. It is in fact the collective intelligence sinking. <laughs> So, just throwing that out there. Would you like to talk about this, Lois? This falls in line with stupid stuff that our, what, government entities have to do because of the collective idiocy. <laughs> now, now, see, you bring up an interesting conundrum there. Now, is it the government agency's fault or is it the people's fault? I honestly say... I, I think it's the people's fault. Yeah, because, well, you know what? But I look at it as they are enablers. Yeah, you, you know what I'm saying? Right, yeah. Because if, if, if they keep warning about it, so, so other, it just, uh, I don't know, I don't know. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this across uh, here. So it's pretty much a, a chicken or egg yeah, type of thing. Which one is it? I don't uh, know. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, if right. you take off the warning labels, this is less likely to happen. Brian says, I want out of California, believe me, but not back to pay. <laughs> I got out of there in 92 and don't plan on moving back unless Anne Begay moves back. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't say that I blame you. Especially after last night's grocery store fiasco. Oh, we're not going into that. I'm, oh. I'm happy. <laughs> There are, you know, there's a lot of things that I like about the area, but there's a oh, lot of oh. stuff that, uh-oh. Brian says the bat looks like my wife's sister. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Oh, oh, no. Now you gotta send us a picture so we can do a side-by-side. <laughs> -side. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> All right, so let's, let's, uh, let's go ahead and move back to the idiocracy <laughs> level of this. And for those of you that don't know, idiocracy is is supposedly a comedy. It's a movie, um, you know, like, uh, and it's supposed to be funny. Well, it ended up turning into being a, a, a more of a, a a predictive thing. Documentary. Yeah, a predictive documentary <laughs> that is now just sad and slightly horrifying. <laughs> So, I'm going to go ahead and transition this over. Go, go ahead, Lois. Let, let's talk oh about this. Oh, my goodness. And so, so, this is still PG-13, but we have to yes. talk about this. Yes. Because, oh. Oh, yeah. This was put up last week. Okay. All right. Of, uh, was it last week or the week before? Um, from the CDC. <laughs> of all Yes, things. this is the CDC's this official is, Twitter feed. Uh, yes. We say it because people do it. Don't wash or reuse condoms. <laughs> Apparently. That's a thing. That's a thing. People wash them out and reuse them. No. <sighs> Just no. <laughs> no, no, no. Now, I know I have seen this idea in, um, it was either a TV show or a movie. What? So, uh, where Is this a was serious done. serious thing? No, where this was done. It was supposed to be a comedy. Oh. Well, uh, apparently whoever watched it didn't realize it was a comedy. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. But, oh, yeah. Collective I intelligence. Just I saw this and I went, oh, no. There are <laughs> people that are that dumb out there. I just. You know, that really shocks me because I've met no. a lot of idiots in my life. But I've never met one that's quite that stupid. I don't think. I mean, I could be wrong. Jamie oh, no. says, what? now that's got to make a girl feel special. Right? <laughs> Let me just wash this out real quick. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> See, now what gets me is, okay, the CDC puts out things like this. All right? Yeah, well, it's because like warning it's labels. Thing. It, they, that's why they, I mean, that's with the warning labels. If it hadn't happened, they wouldn't have to say it. The fact that it happened, right. it's like, what? But what gets me that just dawned on me is 
they don't have to put things out like this on tattoo needles to make sure your tattoo artist opens a new needle. <laughs> right? <laughs> it's like, what? <laughs> I, 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 it just, no. <laughs> Apparently, it's a problem, though. I mean, if it's a big enough problem where the CDC has to put this out on Twitter, lost. my hope for humanity is just... We're lost. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Idiocracy is here, people. Brace oh, for impact. Oh, David says... Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, it, we got more we, comments. Sorry, all at once. Comments. Renee says, I just threw up in my mouth a little. <laughs> Yes, definitely. David says the ultimate of cheap. <laughs> Pretty much. Kelly says, God, no. Gross to the power of infinity. Exactly. Brian oh. says, now we're trying to figure out what sister. <laughs> oh, no. We just had another one pop oh. in there. <laughs> oh, 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 Jamie, you went there. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, <laughs> no. Yes, they are. They are. So, Jamie oh. says, teenage girls are snorting these. Yes, yes they are. They I are. saw a video of that the other day. <laughs> <laughs> and those are the kind of people that we need to stop from spreading. Renee but if they're bleach. doing this, it's not working. Renee what? says bleach. Yes, bleach. <laughs> Chlorine in the gene pool is necessary at this point. I just... I saw this, okay, and I realize, you know, coming from CDC, you're talking something serious, yada, 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 because if it wasn't, one would think, the CDC wouldn't be putting it out. However, this came across my feed yesterday from a major news company. Are you serious? As an, as an article. Oh. And I'm going, no, we're not doing an article on this. This is morning show fodder, because... No. <laughs> yeah, if you're that dumb, <coughs> knock yourself Excuse out, me. man. I'm just... <laughs> you are beyond saving. David says, I second that, David and Renee. <laughs> yeah, I saw the video with the chick. Apparently there is a new... What, what do they call those? Challenges? <gasps> and that's one of the new ones, is that these, these girls take the condoms and they snort them and then pull them out of their mouth. What? Yeah. Just no. Yeah. No. And then apparently they're the ones that are washing these things and using them. Maybe yeah, I, don't I, I don't know. Um, Jamie says, "Who are ra are who who's raising these dum dums?" Brian says, "Are they dishwasher safe? <laughs> are they what? <laughs> dishwasher safe? As long as you don't use Tide Pods." <laughs> yeah. Well, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and say, use the Tide Pods. Yeah. <laughs> But fill them with bleach first. Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> yes, chlorine in the gene pool. <laughs> this is the only solution moving forward. Oh. I wonder if it's in California. Uh, oh, I don't know. I, I really don't know, but oh. no. All right, Just so. stop. Mm, <laughs> I, it's not gonna. That's the problem. <laughs> oh, this one. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and go with that one, I oh, think. Oh, this one. Yes, yes. So, uh, so I don't know how to trans transition go. from that to this. <laughs> Hold on, I, I got this. I got this. <laughs> so we're talking about weird stuff. We're talking about essential oils. We're talking about we're talking about condoms, and, and, and all of these things. All of these packages have writing on the back. Oh yes, that gives instructions, warnings, details. Well, this came across our screens. Uh, yesterday, at some point, oh, hold on. Uh, Apparently, we're getting three. interrupted here. Let's uh, see what. Uh, no way. No. Uh, uh, yeah. Start with Kelly. Uh, that's what I was yeah. doing. She <laughs> says, "No way. What the heck is wrong with these people? Exactly. What is wrong with these people? What part of no do they not understand? No one is raising them. That's the problem. You know what? You have a point there. <laughs> yeah. They've they've got their tablets. They've got their phones, and zombieism ensues. I mean, you know, you want to talk about zombie apocalypse." We're already there. Yeah. Oh, and by and the you way... You have no room to wiggle on that one. Uh, oh, 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 and... Uh, what, what do you mean? Phone zombie. You are a oh, phone zombie. Every once in a while. Mm -hmm. But um, they're... Uh, just to... Go yeah, off yeah, topic yeah, real quick. Oh, yeah. I, I was looking for this on the CDC's website. Yes. 
And because um, originally I didn't realize yeah, I like, tweeted don't, it. Don't believe it. Yeah, I was like, no. <clears throat> they no. actually have a category for zombie apocalypse on there. Yes, I know. It's Preparation yeah. 101 Zombie Apocalypse. Yes, they actually, I remember when they did that and there was a big hoopla about it because they were doing it and they were actually using it as a kind of simulation for the spread of disease, but they were doing it in a fun way. Yes. And then there was all kinds of people that got mad and bent out of shape because they're using tax dollars to come up with a solution for the zombie apocalypse. So, you can't please everyone. Yeah, no, but no. But you gotta I was, please yourself. Oh, it's no. All right now. <laughs> I learned my lesson well. Anyway, all right. So, moving <laughs> on. Warning labels, instructions, ingredients on the backs of packaging. We have been interrupted. We must continue. Yes. On the assault of this this sort of census thing. Although this one is just hilarious because it apparently is. the company that put out this one has a sense of humor. Yes, they do. So remember, whenever you're out shopping or you're finding products, find those companies that you embrace that 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 have a sense of humor that like their customers that that want to be a part of your lives that want to make things better and just have a good time because those companies those are the ones you need to support so that the world is a better place just saying this is hilarious all right i'm gonna go ahead and transition this over right here so you can see this all right well go ahead and tell so about this. this is dog shampoo this is a bottle of dog shampoo and if you can't read it it says Shake well before using. On a wet coat, lather your pat, pat. <laughs> lather your pet thoroughly with a few good palmfuls of Earth Bath Totally Natural Pet Shampoo. Now, what's in the red? Remember to eliminate all escape routes well in advance. A tip: once your pet is slippery wet, he or she is suddenly smarter and faster than you are. <laughs> and it is so true. <laughs> it is true. But I mean. <laughs> You know, that shows a company that actually cares about their product yes. and likes having a good time. I mean, you know, they probably figure most people don't read the instructions, but those that do will pick up on this. It's just fun. It, it is. It is. And <laughs> it just it just killed me when I saw this yesterday. Yeah, it was like, oh my goodness. Because it is true. It is. They, I mean, just... <laughs> <laughs> trying to catch a wet dog. Yeah, it, 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 it just, uh, it, no. Yeah, just, just <laughs> off they go, man. It's like trying to catch a seal. It is, it, it, is, it, it is. In the water. <laughs> it ain't happening. <laughs> Speaking of seals, your dog, the seal pup, as we like to call it. But that's mostly because when she lays down, her legs kind of disappear. <laughs> there's do. this blob on the floor. <laughs> With this cute little face looking at you. <laughs> I know. And then right? it wiggles. <laughs> Yeah, we call her seal pup from time to time. Yeah, but she's a land seal. She's not in the water. She she gets scared of. Yeah, but yeah, she yeah. likes trying to bite the uh, hose water if yes. it's spraying out. Yes. And that's the only way we can bathe her. Yeah. <laughs> While she's attacking the hose. Right. So, oh no. Uh -oh. Yes, wait, wait. yes, Renee, I agree. She says that's funny. Greased pigs. Pretty much. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it goes back to our essential oil <laughs> issues. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> so anyway, make sure you support companies that have a sense of humor and that actually care about the stuff. And, yeah. you know, when, when they do, whether it's the illusion of it or not, I mean, it, it helps promote things that are better than what they were before, which right. improves the overall quality right. of life. Do the same thing with businesses. Just saying. Aren't companies and businesses the same thing? Well, this is a product. Oh, okay. I'm talking yeah. about... <laughs> I know that the same thing, but I'm saying... This is a product that a company puts out. So, you know, support companies right. like this. And then businesses, the ones that care about you, that actually try and make an effort to make your lives better or entertain your day, support those. And the ones that treat you like bleep, well, Yay. don't you go there. You yourself. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> and I know in page that means you probably have to avoid pretty much everywhere, but find the ones that do care and go there. Frequent their businesses. That works. Yeah. Free okay. market, man. Free market. Do we want to transition over? Yeah, sure. I got I got several links here. Oh, up, boy. Up in here. Well, we got about uh, okay. five minutes here. So, Although, I'm going to leave you alone for just a second. I'll be oh, right back. Oh, you are evil. Yeah. Go ahead and disappear because that's like evil. your thing. Yeah, it is. Because I'm short. It's your fault. You built this thing. So, we're talking about shopping and supporting companies that, um, have, you know, share your values or... Or um, what else was it? 
make you laugh and, and things of that nature. Well, I have one that came across my feed. Ah! Oh, and I can't get into it because it's on mine. <laughs> <laughs> so um tomorrow we will have to uh we will have to do it did you break all your links lois no this what did one you do? this one you have to be that person's friend oh. and this is through your feed well, that's not no mine that's um terrible so let's see uh i don't know which one you want to do i don't know um, one. we've got like five minutes we Go have five something. minutes so the one I wanted to do. <laughs> we, okay, well, obviously that's broke. Let's go ahead and move on, Lois. <laughs> All right. So this one reminded me of something out of um, Finding Dory. Finding Dory. Oh, yeah, that's, that's pretty funny. One. That cracks me up. Yeah. If you guys have not <clears throat> seen the movie Finding Dory, you you probably should. Cause yes, that one will is, make you smile. As it, well. Yes. It's disgusting. Maybe. Oh boy. So here is the headline. <laughs> All right, San Antonio Aquarium recovers shark stolen in baby stroller. <laughs> so, <laughs> San Antonio Aquarium recovers shark stolen in a baby stroller. You're going to have to go a little bit more in depth on this one, Lois. So, what? so uh, there was an uh, there was an aquarium in Texas. Mm -hmm. And they have an interactive touch tank. Uh, an interactive touch tank? Oh, right. And and what it is is you have different things swimming around. Oh, you, you can, can like reach in and, and pet them. I, I've been in one of those. Those are fun. <laughs> These people decided to take one of the sharks. They just stole a shark? And stuck it in a stroller. Was there at least water in the stroller? Like some kind and of... They tank? wrapped it in a blanket. <sighs> mm. Was it wet? I they they're not going into uh, if it was wet, but they were able to save the the shark. And, okay, and, good. Because the terrible. shark is, I mean, other than probably being traumatized from know, this right? incident, the shark is okay. okay. Um, but yes, I saw the headline and I went, "What?" <laughs> I mean, they they're not going into why they stole the shark or anything like that, but they transitioned the actual baby. From the stroller into the arms of a person and stuck the shark in there trying to walk out of the freaking aquarium. Wow. That's <laughs> <it's over. laughs> Now, the reason this reminds me of Finding Dory is because of the animals doing this themselves. <laughs> yeah, like jumping from tank to tank and jumping in a stroller. Yeah. Uh, yes, yes. yes maybe, maybe the parents didn't realize that Finding Dory was not actually a documentary. I know, right? It was, um, uh, in fact, made up. Um, okay. And else you didn't know. Renee says, can still see the top of my head. <laughs> oh, that's good. Uh, Gina says, happy they got it back. Yes. Yeah, definitely. And Renee says, good reference. I forgot about that part of the movie. <laughs> and Kelly says, that's sharking. <laughs> oh, she got the puns today. She got the she puns. She does. All right. <laughs> Starting to sound like me out there. What's going on? Oh, uh, so yes, they were able to uh, return the shark back home, and, and well, I'm glad that, that but there's that. But it, it, I know. You know, and with the more of stuff we find like this, I'm telling you, it, it it's <laughs> got to be the general IQ level. It really does. <laughs> I mean, are these people the exception or the rule? I don't know, but I do know when they when they went in when authorities went into their house. Uh -huh. These people have a collection of aquarium style. Oh boy! Oh, oh yeah, <laughs> oh, boy. with fish and exotic. I mean, just the whole kit and caboodle. I think the sharks gonna outgrow your day. <laughs> yeah, just been. <laughs> I hope they got bit. <laughs> I don't know, or or cut. Of course, if they did, then they'd probably sue the aquarium. I am probably right. or or cut on the the shark's skin. Because that oh, does yeah, cut. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Don't rub it the wrong way. <laughs> so so yeah. Um, I saw this headline and I'm going, oh no, oh no. So maybe they did think uh, Finding Dory was a documentary. That's what I was going with. It's not a documentary, people. Finding Dory is a fictitious story. Uh, and if you don't know that, well, I, I know. <laughs> 
I well, think we all know. <laughs> I think on that uh, amazing lack of hope for the future of humanity, <laughs> we're going to have to call it a day. <laughs> oh, Renee says Darwinism at its finest. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think so. This is a continuing theme that uh, is kind of disturbing. Uh, yeah, it is. So, it yeah, is. I think on that, uh, that <laughs> note of the lack of faith in the future of humanity, that we have been progressing through today. <laughs> We're going to have to go see some Rupert and call it a good one. We are going to be covering some other things throughout yes. the day. Um, there is, uh, what, what, what was her name? Wendy Rogers. Wendy Rogers apparently has a, a, a meeting over at the Ranch House Grill or a gathering of some kind where people can talk to her. So a state representative that is running for office actually has come to Page to talk to people. Kind of she's running for Congress. She's yes. running for Congress. So we're going to be going there. We'll see if we can't broadcast live. If not, we'll uh, we'll get back to you guys later with the information on that. Uh, have an amazing day. Make it Definitely. an epic throwback Thursday. Yes. And no hey, matter how hey, bad... throwback Thursday. That shark, you got to throw it back. Yeah. <laughs> I'm say, and no matter how bad you think your day is going, you can always look back at this and see the face and see her face in horror. And it could always be worse. <laughs> You guys have a good one. Bye. <laughs>